I am Sarah. I'm a wildlife cameraman. The spectacular landscape you see behind me is the High Wavy Mountains. And it has a little secret. One of the rarest bats in the world lives in those forests. And I'm hoping I can film it. I'm on my way to meet Rajesh. More than 10 years ago, he came to these mountains looking for the Salimale fruit bat. After days of searching, he found it in a cave under a huge rock. It's such an exciting location to find a rare species like this and I can't wait to film it. Hey Rajesh! The Salimale's fruit bat was first discovered in these mountains in 1948. Besides being one of the rarest bats, it is also evolutionarily very distinct. It is the only living member of a very unique group of bats, which is quite something. The Salimali fruit bat is endemic to the Western Ghats and is found in just a few pockets. It is estimated there are just 800 bats alive today, which makes it critically endangered. Ah, this looks so stunning, no? Yeah, beautiful. So is this Salimali fruit bat habitat? Yeah, what I've seen so far is they basically want something where there's kind of less humidity, more moisture, and kind of dark place. Should it be deep inside? Not really. It doesn't need to be too big cave, but ample space for them to fly around and there's a water body close by. The last time Rajesh came here was more than 10 years ago. This place has changed a lot since then. The cave we're looking for could be anywhere in the deep valley. The only thing we know is that it is along a stream. To reach it, we need to climb down to the bottom of the valley. Right below this, okay. where we're standing, is the rock. I don't know if that's the place you saw it the last time. And the possibly the bats are there. Wait, 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 wait. This is the one. So he's saying through this crevice. You can see some crevices, there should be some bats here. I can see some black marking here. Looks like Gona marking, I guess. Uh, looks like these are primarily a fruit bat uh, based roost. Yeah, I think this looks like leftover fig fruit. We call hornbills as the farmers of the forest. I mean, what hornbills do, and other birds do at the daytime, bats do at the nighttime. So they bring the food, sit here, kind of eat them, chew them, and then kind of leave the droppings that were left over here, then go back search for food and then come back with the food. It's like a dining room basically. Correct, yeah, sort of dining room, exactly, yeah. yeah. So this is another potential cave, and Rajesh is going to explore it. Yeah, this is actually a good place for uh, bats like Hippocerus and Rhinophos. You can see a big huntsman spider here. You come looking for bats behind frogs. Oh, you know, most caves have frogs as well. Uh -huh. Snakes, frogs, crickets. So the secret to knowing if there are bats in a cave is to not look up but to look down, right? Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Only to that is, if there are any bats roosting here, uh -huh. you definitely get a stench. Mm -hmm. The bono smell, probably okay. outside the cave itself. Okay, so we have two caves, no bats. Looks like that's the rock where I've seen the cave. Must be somewhere below. 
We just need to be careful. Yeah, it looks like a yeah. 70 degree slope easily. Seriously, yeah. Now I'll go with the side. Let's oh, okay. Whoa, look at this. This is an amazing looking cave. You know, when I started this quest to search for Salimut's food bag, I didn't expect that I would be seeing them again after 10 years. It's worth all the trouble that we've taken. Absolutely fantastic. These paths are really shy. You know? They are hiding behind the crevice there. And I can hardly get to see them. But once in a while, one of them just pops out and, you know, and I'm able to get a couple of shots. I'm going to set up these flashes to get a broader perspective of the cave ecosystem. This is probably the first time ever the Salimali fruit bat is being filmed. And I feel privileged to be here doing it. I'm really hoping that the shots we get here will help bring awareness to the species. This is one of the rarest bats in the world and it really needs a lot of attention. And Salimunis food bat is one of those unique bats which is found only in certain parts of southern India. They are one of the critical players in the ecosystem. In order to protect the rainforest, we had to protect these bats. 